right, so here's a little, a little warm up to what's about to happen with this amp shootout. We got this orange cabinet set up. We found the sweet spots. It's a crisscross of H75 and a vintage 30. And uh, we kind of experimented yesterday. Man, that thing sounds killer. They sound really great together, miking each each of the speakers. The vintage 30 is kind of brighter and I don't know, more almost fuzzy. Um, and the H75 is is like thicker and more chunky and darker. And uh, you can kind of record them simultaneously, phase them. I just used 257s yesterday, so that I had the same exact mic set up. Um, as a reference point, but I'm going to experiment with some different mics. I have, you know, 421s and 609s and all that, so I'm going to experiment on getting the best sound. But uh, that was it. And then um, I think we're probably going to use for the shootout is going to be the APIs and the Montessis. Um, I love that Montessi red for heavy guitars and APIs and the Montessi blue. I think I'm just going to use those four in a row. Um, just because they don't have step volume. So, because each time I use an amp, it's going to be a different volume. So, it'll be easier for me to keep the volumes the same for the shootout. And that's that. No compressors, none of that stuff. Um, and then the guitars. And basically, um, I'm going to use probably these four four guitars. I'm going to use uh, the Sunburst with the Godwood. I'm going to use the Gold Top with the Cold Sweat. I'm going to use the Yellow Special with the Rebel Yell for the drop tune stuff. And then I'm going to use the Telecaster with the uh, Lawler Special Tees for, for single coil stuff. And that's it. And basically, what I'm going to do is move these chairs out of here. And this is going to be, I don't know, it's hard to tell if you don't know what this place looks like. But we're going to basically, across here, is stack all of the amps up. Right across there. And uh, I got some, like, super incredible gauge speaker wire from a buddy of mine. And uh, we're just going to run wires out. We're going to use two cabs. Um, we're going to use this orange cab for the drop tune stuff. And we're going to use the Scumbag 412 with the M75s for the standard tuning stuff. Um, and each of them is going to have two mics on them. And they'll be phased. And, and that should be it, man. It should be good. It should give you guys a good representation of of what these amps sound like you know I'll have my amps in there and I know Dave Friedman's bringing a bunch of amps and Jerry at Lux Tone and the guys at Tone Merchants uh, are bringing a bunch of amps uh, Jim from Bogner's bringing a bunch of amps um, a bunch of the distributors are are gonna be bringing by amps and then a bunch of people are gonna bring it by amps and then I've got some friends too that are are gonna come by and um, that's it it should be cool should be very very cool so there you go man hey guys say hey Hi. <laughs> you ready to rock mercedes yeah what's that time <laughs> two to go two to go three to go and that's it man so that's the spot it's going to be insane here on the 20th it's going to be packed with people tons and tons of people tons and tons of amps and, uh, yeah, it should be good, man. It should be unbelievable. Cool, good time. Bruce Bouillet said he may come by and play. I'm actually meeting him on Saturday for a lesson. And uh, I talked to my buddy. I don't know if you guys know who John Ziegler is. I'm trying to get him to come by and play. And uh, he's another L.A. guy. Really, really great guitar player. Anyway. That's it. I just figured I'd keep you guys ramped up on what's happening. This, uh, this is it, man. The Amp Shootout. Saturday, June 20th.
put together an orange cab. And also, we sent out my yellow Les Paul Special just now to Jerry at Lux Tone. And he's going to be putting the Fralin Hummus P90s in it. So we may even crack open a little bit of P90 action. Anyway, that's it, man. This is my office. Fan is on. Yay! Look at this. My future child.